Thanks for checking out this unboxing video, and this is the Bambox Horror for the month of August. A little bit late, not bad though. The original box is actually going to be uh, a little bit more late because apparently the prop replica they have coming for this one, which Adam MacArthur, the CEO, owner, founder of Bambox, says is one of their best they've ever done, so we'll see. Um, he says that it's still not, um, it's still not uh, dry. So, you know, anyway, we'll wait on that one, but I'm happy that the BAM Horror one is here. The BAM Horror one is my favorite, typically, so really excited about that. I know, I think I remember like two of the properties that are supposed to be in here. I uh, did want to say real quick, though, some of the things that the BAM box is doing, Adam MacArthur said that going forward, I think starting with this box, if I'm not right, it's the September box, they're going to be putting in like random other things into boxes, such as uh, more rare... Um, autographs like bigger name people uh, randomly here and there and then they're gonna do something they call kind of like golden tickets where it'll be like a ticket for a free band box or a free expansion pack because they do expansion packs every now and then where it's usually a bigger name person and the value on those is usually somewhere between like 60 to 90 bucks so if you get one of those really good value so let's dive into this and see how it is uh, band box been doing pretty well so just cut into this sucker. Sorry if you end up hearing my cat, because she just ate dinner, and for some reason after she eats dinner, she likes to yell. I don't know. There's some tissue paper for her. right over there, so she should enjoy that. And tissue paper number two, and a third one for her. There you go, Chloe. Enjoy that. All right, first thing. Prop replica. It's small. You know I'm not huge on prop replicas, but we'll see. Every now and then. What is this? It's a ring of sorts. I don't... Damn. I can't place this. I really can't. Sorry for the glare, but... Okay. This is a ring, everyone. Does it look like... I want to say the mummy, maybe? Like, this looks like some, like, old Egyptian jewelry. I want to say, like, the mummy. I think that might have been one of the properties. I don't know. We'll find out in the spoiler sheet. Anyway. Oh, cat's already playing with the tissue paper. So if you hear that. Uh, boom. This is nice. I'm sorry. Glare. Uh, one-up card. Yes, one of the one-up cards. Does it say specifically on here? No, it just says up... Upgraded. I wish they would say on here what that means got upgraded. I know there's there's a color system, but I've just never been able to figure it out. I've gotten blue, green, yellow, red now, and I just don't know. Never know what they mean. Anyway, now here's the pin. The thing I'm always like, please let it be good. And this is by designed by uh, Brian Romero. And it <laughs> it's Freddy Krueger, man. Which is awesome because if people saw my, it's very awesome and timely that is, because if people just saw my recent video that I did of the uh, Monster Mania convention that I went to, I met Robert England, the original Freddy Krueger, and he was a super nice guy. Um, if you want to know more about that, you can check out that video. It's Monster Mania convention number 40, and it was pretty awesome. I like this. Let me see. Is this one of the rare ones? I'm going to check to see if there's a number on the back, and that'll tell me. Nope. So I guess this is not the upgrade. So we'll find out. But that's cool. I like it. I like like the little green and blue, um, green and blue, green and red bow tie. Sorry, I just got done with work and like my brain's kind of fried. But I saw this and I was like, gotta unbox it. So plus this is I think this is the type of video that people are mainly looking for on my channel, not the other stuff I do. Anyway, uh, here's the art print. It's a fan from the fan art collection, and it's done by Oscar Van. And what the? Oh, okay. Yes, I know what this is. Okay, now now this is one of the properties I actually remember. This was thirteen ghosts, and I got number four hundred and twenty three out of five hundred. So I'm assuming this was my upgrade because out of five hundred, because I know I know there are more band boxes than five hundred. Here you go. I just want to make sure you can see it. Without there is there glare on up top? I'm sorry if there is. There you go. You can see it. Um, I don't really. 
I mean, I guess I get what it is. It's kind of hard at first when you see it to kind of figure out. Actually, when I hold it back and look at it on the screen, I can see it a lot clearer because it's actually like blurry when I put it up there. I don't know if you could tell that as much, but it's kind of like blurry like you're about to pass out, which I think is actually a, a scene from 13 Ghosts where like some of these ghosts are coming at him. I don't think it was all of these. I think it was just added for this fan artwork, but um, I don't know if I really like that because you have to kind of look from further away to get a good idea of what it is, but it says Terror Wants Company. I like that. It's not a huge fan of that. I mean, I see the place for it, but it's just not my, it's not my bag. All right, then the autograph. This is, okay, well, I'm not a fan of this, so, you know, maybe someone out there is, someone will be, uh, the print looks cool, though, that the signature's on. So this is a signature, this is from the game, uh, which I know is really popular. I've seen people play it online. I haven't played it myself. Doesn't look like a game I'd really necessarily be into. But this is Five, Night, Five Nights at Freddy's. And this, who signed this? Kellen Goff is the voice of Freddy. So if they're going to get someone from that game, the fact that they got the titular voice for the game is pretty cool. So I guarantee there are some people out there who are really going to like this. And like I said, the print looks really nice. Like, very vibrant colors. Looks nice. I like the way it looks. It's just not for me. I'm just not a fan of that. But, you know, that's what ends up happening with a lot of these boxes. You're not going to love it. All the properties for everything. All right, so the Five Nights at Freddy's signing. Five Nights at Freddy's, do 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 do. There were a few different things you could get. Actually, a few different things. It looks like some things were like kind of like toy-type items. So you can see right there, that print's pretty cool too. I like that print a lot. I'm actually really glad that I got the one I did. So, and I was right. It's from the Universal The Mummy. You know, Boris Karloff played The Mummy. Pretty awesome. There's a ring from there. That is a good, that's a good looking prop replica. And it's like, where is it? It's like legitimately got some heft. It's like actual metal. So, you know. Uh, the different pictures you could have gotten for 13 ghosts I, I actually like the regular one more than the out of 500 um but i'm also not like crazy big into 13 ghosts so that's fine so i'm not like that let down <laughs> these are good good pins for the freddy krueger oh the limited out of 250 it's so crude and rude but it's so great and the out of 99 is cool too but look at that i really honestly with that you couldn't go wrong like all those Freddy ones look really good. You cannot go wrong. I'm happy with that. And then uh, they were having a special giveaway. You could win a Robert England signed Freddy 11 by 14 photo. And if you look down there, sorry, look down there, that's it. Looks good. Looks real good. Awesome. So overall, not really a big fan of this because I didn't really particularly like the style of it. But also, I'm just not huge on 13 Ghosts. Um, I like the way this looks. The print's really cool. Uh, it's great that they got the titular character for this game. I'm just not into that game. Uh, I do think this is cool. Uh, I don't think I've ever actually seen the original Mummy. Um, but I should actually see it. Uh, that's really well made. I don't know if I'll display that or not. But I really, really, really like this. Because it's Freddy Krueger and... Who doesn't freaking like Freddy Krueger? Who likes horror? Well, I'm sure there are people, but that's not me. Anyway, thank you everyone for checking this out. Uh, go ahead and keep looking for the original unboxing BAM box. Uh, it is going to be a little bit later. They didn't. They haven't said anything about particularly when that's going to end up showing up. So I haven't even gotten a shipping notice for it yet. So. It might be sometime next week or after that. I don't know. But as soon as I get it, trust that I'm going to have the video up. So I'm going to make my pitch to you guys right now. If you like to see these videos, if you want me to potentially expand in the future and do something different, I can do that, you know, do some more unboxings or whatever else. I'm doing a lot more horror type stuff coming up. I'm going to do like some lists of like my top list of like top 10 or top five horror related this or that um maybe branch out to some other things as well but there's just some things in the works but if you could just take a quick second totally painless 
hit the subscribe for me. If you want to know when all my videos are dropping, then go ahead and hit the notification bell and that'll let you know. Uh, you can do some likes, you can do some thumbs down, whatever you know you feel. I don't really care. That's fine. And then uh, put some comments down there and we can get nerdy about horror stuff because I love to get nerdy about horror stuff. Love horror stuff. Yeah, I mean, you can see back here, Doug Bradley's signature PJ Souls right there. And then my other ones are like way up there uh, and back there and over there. I have a bunch of like signed horror stuff, so, but anyway. Oh, actually, I have the, if people want to see it and not have to go to the other video, I actually have my signed Freddy thing. I haven't put it up yet, so, sleep kills. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Anyway, I'll end it on that, and thank you everyone for checking this out, and until next time, keep it brutal.